Hi everyone, it's Kate. Welcome back to my channel. I am here to do a plan with me in my Panici Planner by the Penny Pages. This is the first, I think, plan with me that I'm doing on my channel um, in this planner. I got it in, um, I started it in July, it came in June, and I am uh, super excited to show you how I am using it. Um, I am going to be using a kit from my shop. Uh, this is kit 105 and these are elements that I just added to the shop um, for the uh, Panici and Hobo Weeks planners because anything that fits in the Hobo Weeks will fit in here and vice versa with the exception of these um, top boxes here. However, you can do whatever you want on the um, sort of extra page here. So um, if you are not familiar with the Penny Pages Panici Planner, it is a hobo um, esque planner, if you will. The only difference is, other than the size, it's a little bit taller because it has these boxes. Um, in the Hobo Weeks, this sheet is over here and this one is over here. That's the only difference. I use this planner as my shop planner, so anything to do with uh, planning out design and days that I'm working on orders and that kind of thing. Um, and I am going to show you how I lay it out today. So these are sheets 13A 13B, <clears throat> 13E, and 13F from the shop. Um, sheets C and D are also washi, but they are uh, longer. They fit the other two sizes of the Panici planner. So they look like this, just longer. Okay, so it has been a minute since I was last on here. I actually in July, I filmed at least one, if not two videos. Um, I did a whole week long series um, in my memory keeper where I filmed each night as I was, um, as I was doing my memory keeping. But in the end, even though I tried to be super, super quick each day, like really sort of, you know, efficient with my, um, with my time, it was going to be like a two and a half hour long video. And I honestly didn't know, did I put that on upside down? No. I honestly didn't know in the end if that was something that anybody would watch or want to see. So I didn't end up posting it. Um, you can let me know down in the comments if it is something you'd like to see. I'm the kind of person, like, I like long videos because I like to, um, watch them while I'm either doing my own planning or working on something. Um, so I like them, but I know not everybody does. And yeah, I just, in the end, I just wasn't sure that I should put it up. I will say I think I've become a little bit quicker at doing my memory keeping each night because it was a new planner to me at the time. Um, <clears throat> but even if it took me, oh, that's crooked. It, it may just be the sheet that's a little crooked, but let me look. Yeah, I think it is. Um, but you know, that's still an hour video at the end of the day. So or sorry, more, more than that, because I can't count. It's 20 times seven, it's a 140 minute <laughs> video. So yeah, you guys let me know if that's something you'd wanna see. I mean, I think I still have the footage from it. It barely needed any editing because I was just, I just refused to cut anything out of it. Um, so I mean, I could still post that one if, if you guys wanted to see it. All right, so there is the very, very base spread. Now what I do, so you get, um, on sheet 13A, you get all of your basics. So you get a little, I'm gonna call it a deco box. It's still functional. Um, on 13E, you do get more of these if you if you do want them, but I do like to have a box on each day. Um, and I'm just gonna start from the bottom. So I am not going to tell you today that I am going to commit to making a ton 
um, of new videos in the near future. I would absolutely love to, but the fact is that we are moving at the end of September, so about a month from, it'll be a month tomorrow actually. Um, last week of September, we are moving. This was not something we had planned. It is not something that we wanted to do. Um, but we unfortunately don't have a choice as our landlady is planning to move family into the unit and, um, Unfortunately, well, I mean, unfortunately, it, unfortunately, that is a legal reason to have your tenants leave. So that is what is going on right now. We only found out, um, oops, let me start from the bottom on these ones too. We only found out, um, maybe maybe a month ago now. I can't, I honestly can't remember. Um, it's probably been about a month. And so then we had to jump into finding somewhere new and, um, this is a crazy rental market right now. So that was not an easy thing to do. We did find a place. We are quite, happy about it. We're quite excited about where we're going to be. Um, but yeah, it's just, it's stressful. So I'm going to try to share parts of the move with you guys if I can. Um, I'm not going to commit to vlogging everything because I just don't think I'll have the time between like before moving, we have to, so we have the TPC sale coming up in September, um, which is like, I think it starts two weeks from today. Um, and we have, uh, we have to seriously downsize. Um, our belongings because we are seriously downsizing our space. Sorry, I just had to grab a drink, which again, I am excited about. I love small spaces. I love not owning a lot of stuff. I'm very excited about that, but it is, it is going to be a lot of work. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. Um, so one of the things that I do in this planner, uh, that doesn't involve a sticker from my shop, it is a sticker I make, however, is this. So this is a little sticker that I designed that I put over here that just helps me keep track of my, um, design work. So it's got sort of all the steps that I go through when designing and I just pop it over here and attempt to lay it down straight. Oh, sorry, that's my computer telling me it's three o'clock. I forget that she talks to me sometimes. All right, so I'm gonna put that there and then I'm gonna grab, I think I'm gonna grab this washi and just pop it in here, I think. A little bit not straight but that's okay um i don't usually use the top washi in this planner i do love the bottom one though all right so here is how i use this planner um over here i put anything that's like super important for the day that i need to remember so monday for example is going to be um a shipping day so i'm going to write that in i should also date this while i'm here Um, and I'm just going to date it by hand. So we are starting with the 30th. Um, so yeah, so shipping day would go in here. Tuesday, the Instagram loop starts for TPC. So I'll put that in there just so I'm 
keeping um like remembering it when it comes time um and then over here i just put whatever is happening for the shop that day so it's really going to be design 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 because so i have a lot of kits to design all of these are going to be full um up here usually i just i leave them blank to start and then things that pop up during the week that i either need to remember or um need to keep track of or things like that uh come back to they go up here in these boxes they work perfectly for that and then down here is just notes and scribbles sometimes it's measurements for new planners um that i might be designing for um sometimes it's um again just other notes like up here that kind of thing i um don't often add uh, these boxes, any more boxes over here, this is just typically for note space um, and to-do list. However, I do sometimes stick them here if I need to um, just note something down. So that is what these, the rest of this sheet and the and this one here are perfect for. All right, that was quick and easy, but I did want to show you how the uh, Hobo kits look in this planner. They would look the exact same minus this and just reversed in the Hobonichi weeks, if that is what you are using. Um, and yeah, these are in the shop. They're in the shop now for, this is kit 105, and they are in uh, for 107 through 109 and soon to be 110 and I will be going back to add them for 101, 102 and 103 and 104 <laughs> uh, in the next little while. All right, I hope that you enjoyed this video as quick as it was. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button and don't forget to check me out over on Instagram and Etsy at A Pretty Planescape. I'll see you all again soon. Bye, friends.